So you're perusing the internet and you come across two guys in a boat, which is a lot more wholesome than what you thought you were gonna find. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian, you're watching Angling Anarchy, and if you get that joke in the beginning, shame on you. And if you don't, let's just pretend it never happened. Um, <laughs> we're out fishing, and when I say we, I have Mr. Noah Humfeld in not my boat, we're in his boat today. Tiller it's, life. It's so weird, it's so strange. <laughs> but uh, Noah is a guide. Uh, Madison Angling is the name of his guide service, and if you would like to catch a muskie or a smallmouth or any sort of fish. Oh wait, 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 wait. What? Okay. Just a second. Or, if you want to catch some walleyes, we can do that too. Don't ask. But yeah, so Noah's a guide. I'll put his info uh, in the uh, description below. He also has a YouTube channel. So we are out here filming. We are trying desperately to catch a muskie because I seem to be terrible at that lately. And uh, Noah's been halfway decent at it. Kinda. Kinda. So, yeah. yes, go over to his channel, check it out. He's got a nice 46 incher that he caught recently. So, yes, that is the plan. I'm gonna stop yapping, and we are gonna catch a muskie, I think. Jesus. Fish. Oh my gosh. Ready? Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> come here, girl. Come on, girl. Tell me to come back there? Okay. She's hooked pretty good. Yep. Oh, Bro! <laughs> nice work. High five. Nicely done. Dude, right. that is. Uh... Here. Why don't you reel your line up? It's yep, we'll do it. Messy, I got the net. Okay. Alrighty. I'm, I'm like not even ready for this, man. This is way well, too soon for this to happen. You're <laughs> and you're like, you sure? You sure you want to start sure? there? Yeah. You think okay. we should start there? Yes, we should How start here. How many casts was that? Like seven. Dude. That's nice. awesome. All right, let's get to work here. All right. I want to hold this for a second. Yep. We're a good solid like five casts in, and uh, Captain Knucklehead over here decides to catch a muskie. Like, I wasn't even ready for this. Let's do it. Let's see what he gets. Captain Knucklehead. <clears throat> Would you mind grabbing the bump cord? Yeah, we're right there. Right behind. Right there. Hey, we got a tag. We got a tag? We got a tag, boys and girls. Oh, boy. Uh-oh, I'm not recording. Are you recording? I'm recording. This. Awesome. Brian's recording. So we're going to get a quick picture here of our tag number. Whoa. There we are. So we are uh, in the midst of a growth study here in Madison comparing the Leech Lake and Wisconsin strain fish that are stocked here. And about half of the fish that get stocked get pit tags in them, the same stuff you put in your cats and dogs. And some of us have scanners, so when we get a fish, we scan it. If it comes up with a tag, we record the tag number, bump the fish, send that info to the DNR, goes into a big database, and uh, yeah, hashtag science. So let's take a look at this fish, guys. I'm pretty excited. That was like seven casts, and bam, we got a fish. High skies, sunny, people paddling around everywhere. Catching muskies, man. It's so cool. She angry. She's probably gonna be mean. All right. Certainly not a super mega, but a great fish. And it looks like she actually got caught before. Look at this wound in her, the side of her jaw there. That's not for me. She's kind of getting ready to popcorn here. Okay. So let's real quick. Ooh. 
So notice what my first move was there, guys. Hang on and get it to the side of the boat. It's better to fling them in the water than it is to drop them. So this fish is gonna probably flip out, but because it has a tag, we do wanna measure this fish. We are at 35 and a half. Solid 35 and a half incher to start out our afternoon here. And uh, it's all about, it's about all I got to say about that. So we're gonna go ahead and get her back. She's ready to popcorn on me again here. And there we go. Just get her in the water, let her go. Obviously healthy, angry enough to swim away just fine. So best thing to do if they popcorn, just get them out of the boat, guys. Just get them out of the boat. Well, that's the longest I've ever recorded with this camera and I wasn't talking. But he did a fine job, didn't he, people? Nicely done. Thank you. All right, um, yeah, we're like a couple minutes into this and we're gonna keep going. The reason for that is twofold. First being, you're not supposed to catch a muskie that fast when you're muskie fishing. We completely and utterly jinxed the entire operation by doing that. Secondly, I had the audacity to say in my little outro after we caught the fish that hey maybe we'll get another one. Yeah, stay away from those two things. If you learn nothing else from this video other than that, you are so far ahead of the game. Joking aside, and maybe not joking, but that aside, we are in uh, the final hour or so here. We've got awesome top water conditions. We've not seen much for fish. Noah had a hit in this general area. He is going to be rocking, uh, if you can see it out there, a Lee Lures flap tail. I'm still throwing a Navin, uh, but we may switch over to a flap tail, uh, depending on how much action he gets. Or I might go with a uh, Big Mama Bubba, little walk the dog bait. That's the plan, we'll see what happens. If nothing else, at some point along the way here, when Noah gets the info back from that uh, beautiful little tagged fish that we had, uh, we'll share that info. That's always kind of fun to look at when we get that from the DNR, so at some point we'll look at that. But yeah, we're just gonna keep trying for one. This is, it's a major, it's, we got a cold front coming in. It's good, it should be good. Should Let's be see good. if it happens. Fish. Just came off. Little guy. So hang on a second, everybody. I gotta tell you something. Right? Yes. Listen. I don't want to tell you how to do your job, <laughs> but I need you to catch this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No, that would be good. All right. I'm glad we have this time. Oh boy. <laughs> the streak continues. <laughs> Jeez. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I spooked him off, I think. Little guy. It was. <laughs> it actually looked like the one I moved the other day. It was straight across over by the bridge there. Yeah. That was the one that was blind in one eye. Oh, okay. Yeah. He just kind of snuck up on it at the end and was doing the old mouthy thing. <sighs> This is sort of an outro because at the very end of this video, Noah is going to send in the info on that fish to the DNR and we are going to get some info on that fish. So we'll get to that after this. This yes. is just wrapping up tonight. Uh, a great day in the water. Uh, always fun to fish with my buddy Noah. 
Madison Angling YouTube channel and guide service. Check it out. I'll put it in the description down below. We got ourselves a fish. We did. Which, I mean, as long as the boat doesn't sink, <laughs> we'll call it a win. So um, getting a fish. I lost one. So uh, there were definitely a couple fish moving towards evening, but not like we were hoping for. Not quite the action we were, we were planning on and hoping for, but that's musky fishing and that's musky fishing on Metro water. And it's been kind of tough. I mean, there's been some, some really good days and there's been some really kind of not good days. And the fact that we got a fish, I'm going to say that was a good day. So. We're going to call that a win people. So <laughs> it's only going to get better. Yes. <laughs> um, and I, I need to catch a muskie so bad. I've gone for like a month now and I just, I keep losing them. So I've got the muskie yips at the moment. So we will try to <laughs> remedy that right after this. We'll talk about the fish we caught and then we'll wrap it up after that. All right, well, Noah got the information back uh, from the DNR on that fish that we caught. Stock September 16th, 2015. It was 12.3 inches, and it is a Chippewa strain fish. So, uh, yeah, the fish is about six years old, so she got to about three feet long in that point. Uh, cool information to find out. It would be even cooler to eventually catch one of these fish that we've previously caught uh, and just kind of see how that growth goes. Like Noah said in the video, they are doing a growth study out there to kind of see how the fish are doing. There's a lot of leech lake fish out there. This one wasn't, um, but yeah, it's a cool mix of fish on the Madison chain. There are some giants coming out of there. Uh, Noah got a 53, actually his friend got a 53 and a half last year. Somebody just found a 54 dead this year. So the fish are getting huge out there and a big thanks to Cap City Muskies. Guys, join Muskies Inc. This is one of the best ways to have your voice heard and hopefully get some stocking done uh, in the state of Wisconsin to improve our muskie fishery. All right, we're going to wrap this one up. Thanks everyone for watching. I appreciate every single one of you and I will see you on the next video. Thank you.